Super Valar, Inc. is an American retailing company. The corporation, headquartered in the Minneapolis suburb of Eden Prairie, Minnesota, has been in business for over a century. It is the third largest food retailing company in the United States, and ranks number 75 on the 2012 Fortune 500 list. Supermarket News ranked Super Valar number one in the 2008 Top Wholesalers for 2008. On June 2, 2006, Boise, Idaho-based Albertsons, Inc. and 1,124 of his stores were sold to Super Valar. The sale was approved by the shareholders of both Super Valar and Albertsons on May 30, 2006. In January 2013, the company announced it was selling the Acme Markets, Shores, and Jew Osco chains and their remaining Albertson stores to Cerberus Capital Management for $100 million in cash with Cerberus assuming $3.2 billion in existing debt. Super Valar would keep its cub, farm fresh, shoppers, shopper Euro N safe and Hornbachera Euro unregistered trademark S brands as well as its wholesale supply operation while the Acme, Shores, Star Market, and Jewel Osco stores were reunited with Albertsons. The deal closed March 21, 2013. History In 1870, Hugh G. Harrison provided the money for B.S. Bull & Company, a dry goods wholesaler serving Minneapolis. Though B.S. Bull & Company was short-lived, its founders went on to create a similar company. In 1926, Super Valar's direct ancestor, Winston & Newell Company, was founded from the merger of Winston, Harper & Fisher and the Newell Company, two companies founded by B.S. Bull's backers. Winston & Newell was a charter member of the Independent Grocers Alliance in 1928, but left IGA in 1942 in favor of forming a virtual chain of independently owned stores that operated under the Super Valar and You Save banners. However, it still serves as a supplier to many IGA stores. This concept proved to be such a success that in 1952, the company changed its name to Super Valar Incorporated. The name was modified to Super Valar in 1992. The company has been listed on the New York Stock Exchange since 1967, and was the first voluntary group to be listed there. Equals acquisitions equals, in 1963, the company acquired the Food Marketing Corporation of Fort Wayne, Indiana, which traced its roots to the early 1800s, as Bursley and Company. The acquisition of food marketing brought Super Valar into the institutional market. George W. McKay, the president of food marketing, joined Super Valar as an executive vice president and later as president and chief executive officer of Super Valar in 1970. In 1971, the discount chain Shop Co. was acquired by Super Valar, Inc., and was spun off in 1991 to form a separate, publicly traded company. Super Valar retained a 46% interest in the new company, which Shofco later purchased in 1997. In 1975, Super Valar acquired Horn Batchers. In 1980, the company acquired Minnesota based Cub Foods, which operated five stores in the Twin Cities area. As of 2011, Cub is operating more than 73 stores in Minnesota and Illinois. In the early 1990s, Super Valar started acquiring several chains such as Scott's Food and Pharmacy in 1991, Wetero, Incorporated, and its holdings Shop and Save and Save A Lot in 1992, and Biggs in 1994. Scott's and Biggs have been divested. Biggs was sold to Reemk Markets and Kroger bought Scott's. Super Valar acquired Rich Food Holdings for $1.5 billion adding a mid-Atlantic distribution presence and stores including Farm Fresh Food and Pharmacy, Shoppers Food and Pharmacy, and Metro. On January 23, 2006, Super Valar announced that it, along with CVS Corporation and a collection of investors led by Cerberus Group, agreed to acquire Albertsons, Inc. for $9.7 billion. The acquisition was completed on June 2, 2006. Super Valar acquired over 2150 stores in the deal including, Acme, Acme Express, Jewel Express, and Albertsons Express, Albertsons, Bristol Farms, Jewel and Jewel Osco, Lazy Acres Market, Max Foods, Osco Pharmacy and Zarfon Pharmacy, Save A Lot, Shores, Star Market.
equals today equals today super below operates 2505 food and food drug combination stores 878 in store pharmacies 117 fuel centers and serves as primary distributor to an additional 2,200 stores. Supervalon also supplies a network of independent retailers that sometimes use the Supervalon name. However, these stores are not owned by the company. Supervalon also franchises the Cub Foods and Save A Lot brands to independent retailers. In 2009, former Walmart executive Craig Herker took over for Jeff Noddle as CEO of Supervalon. On January 6, 2011, Super Valon announced it would close 20 underperforming stores on the East and West Coasts as it attempts to save money by allowing corporate and office employees to take unpaid time off. The company, despite being profitable, is facing financial problems due to a weak economy, tight margins, falling revenue and asset values. On January 11, 2011, Super Valor has reported a loss of $202 million for the quarter, and revenue also fell 6% to $8.67 billion. Stock prices fell 12% to $7.52 per share. The company operates on a strategy of effective and efficient food distribution. The company conducts its retail food operations through a total of 2,349 retail food stores and are supplied by 23 dedicated distribution centers and 9 distribution centers. In September, 2011, Super Valon announced the sale of all but 27 of its fuel centers to several convenience store chains, including Tesoro, Holiday Station Stores, Couche Tard, and Stinker Stores. The company announced that it was seeking buyers for the remaining fuel centers as well. On July 11, 2012, after the close of trading, Super Valor reported net sales of $10.6 billion and net earnings of $41 million for the first quarter of fiscal 2013, compared to net sales of $11.1 billion and net earnings for $74 million for the year earlier period. Those results sent Super Valor shares down some 45% after the start of trading on July 12, 2012, and hurt performance of other outstanding Super Valor debt, including its high yield bonds and CDS. On July 30, 2012, Craig Herkert was terminated as CEO of Super Valor, replaced with Wayne Sales. Sales is a former CEO of Canadian Tire. On January 13, 2013, Sam Duncan who had retired as CEO of Naperville, ill-based Office Max in 2011, was named CEO of Super Valor. Overview, as a supplier to IGA stores for over 80 years, Super Valor necessarily has formed close relationships with these family-owned grocery businesses, some of which have had relationships with the corporation for over two or three generations. But Walmart's newly arrived grocery competition to these stores also affects Super Valor, Incorporated. In addition, Super Valor is selling its shop and save stores in the Pittsburgh market as a result of being unable to compete with Walmart and fast-growing local chain giant Eagle. Most will be sold to independent owners, and continue to operate under the shop and save banner. Super Valor will continue to supply all area food land, save a lot and the independent shop and save locations of western Pennsylvania and northern West Virginia. Super Valor enjoys economies of scale when dealing with the well-known national food firms like Kraft Foods, General Mills, Kellogg's, the beer manufacturers, meat suppliers, produce suppliers and dairy suppliers, as well as the health and beauty product suppliers, by purchasing in bulk and then distributing the goods by direct store delivery from its distribution centers, which are located nationwide. The ethnic foods market is an emerging sector and remains a challenge for this business, as well as the natural and organic food sector, as there are no clear market leaders for the corporation to deal with in these sectors. It remains to be seen whether Super Valor's tradition of dealing with small grocery businesses can be extended to these emerging markets. Super Valor brands include, Arctic Shores, Baby Basics, Carlita, Culinary Circle, Equiline. Essential Every Day, Farm Fresh, Farm Stand, Flavorit, Whole Care Pet, Home Life, Java Delight, Max Velocity, Nutri Plan, Richford, Shoppers Value, Stockman and Dakota, Stone Ridge Creamery, Super Chill, Super Crunch, and Wild Harvest. 
Supervalon also owns two third-party logistics firms, Advantage Logistics and Total Logistic Control. In 2005, Supervalon launched a speciality produce company, W. Newell & Company which is headquartered in Champaign, Illinois. Market Share As of 2006, Supervalon has a leading market share position in several markets where it is operations. First, Philadelphia, PANJ+, Minneapolis ST Paul, MN, Fargo, ND, Chicago Illinois Plus, Billings Montana Plus, Nampa Boise Idaho Plus, Las Vegas Nevada Plus, Orange County, CA Plus, Second, Norfolk Virginia Beach, VA, Boston, MANHME Plus, Spokane Washington Plus, St. Louis, MO, Riverside San Bernardino, CA Plus, San Diego California Plus, Ventura California Plus, Duluth Minnesota Superior, WI, 3rd, Pittsburgh Pennsylvania Plus, Seattle Bellevue Everett Tacoma Washington Plus, Washington DC slash Baltimore, MD, Los Angeles Long Beach California Plus. Chains, the company operates under multiple retail banners, or chains, Cub Foods 77 locations of which 31 are franchised, Farm Fresh Food and Pharmacy 46 locations, Horn Batches 6 locations, Save A Lot 1250 locations of which 860 are franchised, Shop and Save 42 locations not to be confused with the Pittsburgh area Shop and Save stores which are no longer owned by Supervilla, Shoppers Food and Pharmacy 56 locations, Supervilla Pharmacies 109 pharmacies, Rainbow Foods 4 locations, Supervilla is not related to Supervilla. Equals former chains equals Acme Markets 117 locations sold to Albertsons LLC, Albertsons 453 locations sold to Albertsons LLC, Acme Express, Albertsons Express and Jewel Express Fuel Centers and Convenience Stores, sold in 2011, Biggs Locations sold to Reemk Markets in 2010, Bristol Farms spun off in 2010, Lazy Acres. Max Foods locations rebranded Lucky, Jewel Osco 182 locations in IL, Eastern IA, Northwestern and in Southeastern WI, sold to Albertsons LLC, Lucky Stores 5 locations sold to Albertsons LLC, Osco Pharmacy and Zarvon Pharmacy 722 pharmacies sold to Albertsons LLC, Scott's Food and Pharmacy sold to the Kroger Company in 2007, Shopco spun off in 1991, Remaining interest sold in 1997, Shaw's and Star Market 169 locations sold to Albertsons LLC. Sunflower Market 5 locations closed in 2008, Twin Villa Hypermarket Concept, closed in 1996. Product Labels, many of the banners have private labels. These are the current active private label brands for Super Villa. Some of the older and active private label brands are, Hill Farm, Economy Buy, Home Best, Essentia, Chateau, Quality Plus, Elf. Culture. Equals diversity equals, Super Valor received a 100% rating on the Corporate Equality Index released by the Human Rights Campaign starting in 2008. Super Valor sponsors employee resource groups globally for Black, GLBT, Latino, Young, Handicapped, and other minorities. Equals environment equals, Cub Foods and its parent company, Super Villa, was the first grocer in Minnesota to be awarded LEED Gold NC 2.2 certification for one of its stores. The Cub Store, located in the Fallon neighborhood of St. Paul is one of just three grocery stores in the nation to successfully achieve LEED Gold certification. Albertsons was the first major retailer to earn a LEED certification on their remodeled La Habra store. It features water-saving faucets, over 40 skylights, night curtains over open cold cases and LED lighting. In August 2009, Super Villa was recognized by the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency for achieving their emissions target. Controversy In June 2002, Super Villa announced a restate previous financial reports due to accounting irregularities uncovered at its pharmacy division. As a result, Shares of the company slumped 18%. On July 12, 2002, 
Superbola lost a lawsuit about employing improper accounting practices regarding the cost of goods sold for at least the past four years, and paid $4 million for settlement. Customer Data Security Breaches Superbola sent a letter to my club rewards members on August 25, 2014 who provided their data and shoppers who used credit cards during the period between June 22, 2014 through July 17, 2014 at 209 Superbola stores and standalone liquor stores who may have been affected by a data security breach. Supervilla posted this information on their website in a press release dated August 14, 2014. Information on the affected stores and eligibility for customers on identity protection programs are available on Supervilla's press release site. See also Grocer, List of supermarket chains in the United States, List of S&P 500 companies, List of companies based in Minneapolis Euro St. Paul, Georgia Newell House. References External links, Supervilla and a Supervilla history, Supervilla store brands, Supervilla 2008 annual report, most recent quarter results Oliver, David. Supervilla reports record first quarter fiscal 2009 earnings. Business Wire. Retrieved October 2, 2008. Supermarket News colon Supervilla profile, Craig Herkert Forbes profile, Cole. Heather. Family-owned Supervilla survives in battle against superstores. St. Louis Business Journal. December 1, 2002.